A few things in this world are reliable, taxes, gravity, and two strokes. And if you have a simple combustion chamber with a spark, air pressure, and gas, it will fire. It's a vintage 125cc motorcycle from 1990, without starter, battery, and all of this sophisticated stuff, but with great potential. And the first thing I want to do before increasing the power is the brakes. I already have a set of wheels from another project and I want to show you the difference. Fortunately, the size of the bearings fits perfectly with the axle. But, as you might notice, the brake drum is not fixed and this rotates. So to fix it, I will use the clamp and a flat bar.
the next step is to change the rear wheel. The original swing arm are too tighter for a new wheel, so I'll change it with the swing arm. But to fit this swing arm to frame, we have to do some manipulation. The swing arm is much wider and we need to shorten this width. And for this I will make a special tool. From a pipe that perfectly fits in size. A nut and a bolt to be able to install it in the drill. That's how it looks assembled. So how it works. At the end I install a grinding disc and insert it instead of the swing arm axis. And it will grind a perfectly flat surface.
The next step is to modify the frame, so we'll need to build a frame jig. Subscribe to don't miss it.